Dinosaurs may be the rock stars of prehistory, but Earth's past was teeming with weirder, even more beautiful creatures. Prepare to explore 15 enigmatic beasts that time has buried, each with details to fuel your imagination. Gecolopterus Forget the stereotypical image of a scorpion. Imagine an eight-foot-long aquatic monster, the Gecolopterus. This fearsome predator had enormous compound eyes, granting it an exceptional vision in the murky depths. Its pincers, designed for snatching unsuspecting prey, were likely powerful enough to crush even hard-shelled creatures. Helicoprian Nicknamed the buzzsaw shark for a reason, Helicoprian had a horrifyingly superb adaptation. Its lower jaw housed a nightmarish arrangement of teeth, a constantly growing spiral of serrated blades. Exactly how it used this chomping machine is still a mystery. Tanistrophius This bizarre reptile had a neck that defied logic. Ever seen a giraffe with a crocodile's head but a neck stretching longer than its entire body? Tanistrophius, lurking on the shores of Triassic lakes, may have used its elongated neck to wad in the shallow water, snapping up fish and insects with its sharp teeth. Titanoboa Titanoboa was a true titan of the snake world. Reaching lengths of 50 feet and weighing tons, it crushed its prey in the jumbles of what is now South America. Envision the sheer size of this humongous constrictor. Dunkleosteus Picture a gigantic armored fish clad in bony plates, resembling a swimming knight. But its most fearsome feature was its jaws. Razor-sharp teeth and a powerful bite that could crush even the sturdiest prey made Dunkleosteus an apex predator of the Devonian seas. Camaroceros This cephalopod wasn't your average squid. Camaroceros had a massive, spiked shell that resembled a ram's horn, a genuinely bizarre adaptation. With an enormous shell, possibly reaching up to 10 feet in length, it may have defense against predators. Anomalocarus Anomalocarus, a foot-long swimming predator from the Cambrian period with shrimp-like features, possessed fossilized eyes 30 times more powerful than trilobites. One specimen boasted over 24,000 lenses in a single eye, granting its sophisticated vision far surpassing anything else in the Cambrian seas. Pentacopterus it was a sea scorpion reaching lengths of five feet. Terrifying and predatory, it patrolled the seas with a paddle-like tail, propelling itself through the water at surprising speeds. Pentacopterus likely breathed through its gills, unlike its land-dwelling cousins, allowing it to remain submerged for extended periods. Megalodon The ultimate prehistoric shark, Megalodon, was a predator that could dwarf even the largest great white sharks of today. Suppose you can visualize teeth, the size of your hand, lining the jaws of this behemoth. It is estimated that Megalodon could grow to lengths exceeding 50 feet and weigh over 50 tons. Hallucigenia Hallucigenia was a bizarre, worm-like creature with a name that lived up to its appearance. It possessed seven pairs of long spines along its back in a unique arrangement. Some theories suggest the spines may have been used for swimming or gliding through the water, while others propose they might have been a deterrent to predators. Quetzalcoatlus It had a wingspan exceeding 30 feet, making it the largest flying animal ever discovered. It soared through the late Cretaceous skies with a wingspan that dwarfed even the most giant modern albatross. Quetzalcoatlus's lightweight bone structure and adaptations similar to those of birds allowed it to achieve powered flight despite its immense size. Arthropleura Arthropleura was a massive myriapod that dominated the Carboniferous rainforests. Reaching lengths of 10 feet and weighing a staggering ton, it was the largest known land invertebrate to ever exist. One of the biggest mysteries surrounding Arthropleura is how it molted, as the process would have left it vulnerable for extended periods. Telemonstrum Nicknamed the peanut worm for its peculiar peanut-shaped body, Telemonstrum is an enigma from the Cambrian period. With a spiny proboscis and a series of grasping appendages, its function and lifestyle remain a mystery. Theorists suggest it may have been a benthic organism living on the seafloor and using its proboscis to probe the sediment for food. Morellomorpha This strange creature from the Cambrian period had a segmented body like a shrimp but possessed stinging tentacles like a jellyfish. 
Scientists assumed the stinging tentacles served a defensive purpose, warding off predators, while the segmented body may have allowed for some form of limited swimming or maneuvering. Hakuichthys Hakuichthys is one of the earliest examples of a vertebrate, dating back to the Cambrian period. Hakuichthys possessed a simple notochord, a precursor to the backbone found in vertebrates today. Studying the Hakuichthys helps scientists understand the development of the anatomical features that define our phylum. 